first? Why was it so important to you, in, in your own words, to push through and to play tonight? Uh, it's the playoffs, and my team needed me. Simple. And secondly, I mean, how are you feeling afterward, and do you plan to play in game six? I feel great we won, so that's all that matters. Um, at this point, it's, you know, by any means necessary. Uh, as long as there's a W on that column, and, you know, we keep we keep racking up wins, it's all that matters. So, um, no, obviously, KD had an unbelievable game, you know, and, and carried us, but just Jeff, you know, made some shots. Uh, this is a great team win for us. Uh, we haven't really had, you know, we haven't really been together, you know, the entire year. We've had so many, dealt with so many injuries or whatnot that, you know, we really haven't had an opportunity or been through adversity, you know. So, you know, we know that there's going to be times in the postseason, you know, where we hit adversity, where things feel like they're up against us or or they can't be done. In reality, they can be done. And uh, we just got to find ways to get them done. And, you know, we showed a little bit at it in that Boston series. And then uh, even this series, it's the same thing. Like, it feels like just when things are going well, it's something hit us. And, you know, my, my approach and, you know, to the guy, to the guys is, you know, keep fighting. Like it's it's always it's gonna be great on the other side. And and we we did that tonight. So uh proud of the guys. Bruce Beck, NBC New York. James, will this be a game that, that you remember not so much for the stats, but for the heart that Harden showed tonight? Yeah, I mean it's not about me, man. It's about the Brooklyn Nets and and us as a team, as a whole. You know, I think individually we all have to do something and bring something to the table to 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 win. Uh, and we did that tonight, you know. So it's not about me. It's not about, obviously, KD had an unbelievable game. But I think it's about everybody else in, as well. And, you know, like I said, Jeff made some big shots. And uh, guys fought. Landry made big shots down the stretch. Like, it's a, it's a total team effort. And like we always preach, it's... It's going to be, you know, different guys, you know, every single game. But, you know, as long as we have that right mindset and we all for each other, good things are going to happen for us. And um, tonight, you know, they did. Brian Lewis with the New York Post. <laughs> Sorry, I was asking, how would you uh, describe uh, Kevin's performance and be for yourself? What would you, uh, at what point in the game did you start to feel like yourself? You know, explosion-wise, mobility-wise. <laughs> uh, Kevin's game was just unbelievable. Like, 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 he was unfazed the entire game. Like, he just, he was poised, especially in that second half. Like, he started to take his time. He started to get to his spots and kind of like, I seen Kevin directing people to where he wanted them to be. And... Once Kevin gets that, like, he's comfortable, he's in his zone, and it's, like, it's pretty pretty much hard to stop him. Um, and just we fed off that, you know. And so, but for me, I'm just, you know, I'm good. I'll be all right. Christian Winfield with the Daily News. Hey, James, kind of piggybacking off of that, you know, 10 assists for Kevin as well. I mean, you as the, the de facto point guard on this team, are you able to kind of enjoy his performance playmaking for everybody else out there when, when you're not able to? Yes, yes. Because, you know, his scoring is unbelievable. Obviously, he shot pretty efficient, but his playmaking, you know, once he got to his spots and the the second uh, defender came over and helped, he made the right decision, you know, mo majority of the time, if not every time. And that's an improvement of, of his game right there. And he's not just a scorer. He's able to make plays and let the game come to him. Um, and, I mean, he's, he's, he's one of a kind. Alex Schiffer, The Athletic. Hey, James, you obviously were ruled out yesterday and then ended up playing today. If you could just kind of walk us through how, did, how you got to this point. You know, did you wake up feeling better? or, or five, you... uh, woke up and was like, you know what? Let's go. Like, it's not, I mean, I tried to go out there and do the best that I can. Um, hopefully, I, I gave my teammates some encouragement, some some life. Um, obviously, I wanted to score the basketball and, you know, do what I normally do. But it is what it is. And we win. And um, then we watch film, get, get our rest, and prepare for game six. 
Like we said it, he just loves the hoop.